Okay, well, I'll get you a stock picks. Um, so, David, you've already sort of partly given us, but maybe you can mm. add something mm. there. But I'm going to ask Wayne first in that case. Wayne, what yeah. are you going yeah, for I'm, this evening? I'm going for the U.S. retailer Target. I mean, I know the share price is being hammered, but it's it's actually, David and I don't have a cup of tea or a cup of coffee or a, a Johnny Blue before, the, meet, before the, 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 the TV. But what he said was very relevant. He said the U.S. is showing signs of slowing down a little bit. And that's exactly what Target said. They said, you know, we've had to cut prices on 5,000 or 10,000 line items because the consumer's under a bit of bit of strain there. But, I mean, that's not the reason why I'm buying the share, is that if you get lower interest rates in the U.S. and it comes quicker than anticipated, there'll be quite a strong rebound mm. of what may be a lower base in consumer expenditure. And Target's not expensive. Eh? Wow. And, I mean, this is a very good retailer. In the previous four quarters, they well outstripped consensus earnings. Just in this quarter, it wasn't up to consensus, because maybe consensus was just too high, given the higher interest rates in the state of the economy. So maybe hold off. The share price is falling now, but I'd go for Target. Okay. Um, and David, would you just uh, pile into Roynet now? I have to say, I own Roynet shares. Um, I bought them last year. I'm very happy that I did, because they've been a yeah. really great buy. Yeah. A good dividend payer. I just, uh, I, I think if you break down where they are um, and understand that um, things are going to change, you know, I, even if they, even if we do have the ANC again, I think slowly things are going to get better. Money has to be spent. And they, they're just well placed. Um, they've just got those kind of businesses that are going to benefit. And what gave me the clue was I, after the results came out, I looked at the, you know, the, the chart and that's, that's at a four or five year high, you know, and it's just creeping up all the time. Okay, I can buy that. <laughs> Pity you didn't yeah. buy it four years ago, but there you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we shall leave it there. And welcome back uh, to SA Shores. Um, uh, David Shapiro is from Sassam Securities. Wayne McCurry is from FNB Wealth and Investments. Up next, so we have the close. Stay with us. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.